welcome to chemistryonline.guru today we will discuss about ionization potential or ionization energy it is the minimum amount of energy required to remove an electron from the valence shell of an isolated gaseous atom or cation it is represented by i e or i p its unit is electron volt per atom or kilo calorie per mole or kilo joule per mole suppose it is a gaseous atom m energy required to remove an electron is ionization energy energy required to remove first electron from an isolated gaseous atom is first ionization energy that is ie1 m plus one electron is removed that energy is equal to ie1 this is ie2 to remove another electron now ie3 this is third ionization energy m3 plus plus electron third ionization energy that is ie3 is greater than ie2 and ie2 is greater than ie1 because removal of second electron from a cation is relatively more difficult because remaining electron in cation are more effectively pulled towards nucleus and requires more energy now factors affecting ionization energy number 1 effective nuclear charge more is the effective nuclear charge more tightly are held electrons with the nucleus and thus 
more amount of energy is required to remove electron hence i e ionization energy is higher second factor is atomic size or atomic radius ionization energy is inversely proportional to atomic radius in a period atomic radius decreases so ionization energy increases atomic radius decreases i e increases next factor is nature of subshell we know there are four subshell spdf closer the subshell of a shell to the nucleus more tightly electrons are held towards nucleus and more is ionization energy ionization energy subshell are s p d and f s subshell is more closer than p than d than f for a shell for example i e1 of boron is less than i e1 of beryllium configuration of beryllium is 1s2 2s2 we form b plus by by the removal of one electron this is first ionization energy of beryllium in the case of boron 1s2 2s2 2p1 one electron in the case of boron one electron is removed from 2p while in the case of beryllium one electron is removed from 2s 2s is more closer than 2p therefore because 2s is more closer than 2p so more energy is required to remove electron from 2s then 2p so i e1 of boron is less than i e1 of 
beryllium. Next factor which affects ionization energy is half filled and full filled subshell. Half filled and full filled orbitals subshells possess stability and it is difficult to remove electron. Hence, more is the ionization energy. For example, IE1 of nitrogen is greater than IE1 of oxygen. In normal trend, IE1 of nitrogen will be less than oxygen but in this case this is exceptional case because in the case of nitrogen 2p subshell is half filled it is half filled in the case of oxygen Four electrons are present in 2p. It is difficult to remove electron from half filled subshell of nitrogen than oxygen. So, more amount of energy is required to remove electron from nitrogen, 2p of nitrogen. Therefore, IE1 of nitrogen is greater than IE1 of oxygen. But second ionization energy of oxygen is greater than second ionization energy of nitrogen because in the case of oxygen second ionization means O plus 1s2, 2s2, 2p3. Now in this case 2p is half filled or in the case of nitrogen it is not half filled. Therefore, more amount of energy is required to remove electron from O plus than N plus. Therefore, second ionization energy of oxygen is greater than nitrogen. Next factor is screening or shielding effect. The phenomena in which penalty made shell electrons act as a screen or shield in between nucleus and valence shell. This is nucleus, this is valence shell. And therefore, reducing effect effective nuclear charge is known as screening effect. More is the screening effect lesser is the effective nuclear charge
एंड लेसर इज द आइनाइजेशन एनर्जी नाउ वन इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन इज आइनाइजेशन एनर्जी ऑफ इनर्ट गैसेस आइनाइजेशन एनर्जी ऑफ इनर्ट गैसेस आर exceptionally higher the reason is stable configuration of inert gases stable configuration of inert gases all the shells are full filled in the case of inert gases so it is difficult to remove electrons from outermost shell of inert gases therefore more amount of energy is required to remove an electron from outermost shell therefore ionization energy of inert gases are exceptionally higher helium has highest helium has highest ionization energy among inert gases if you want a video tutorial on any specific topic of chemistry please comment below if you like this video then like share comment and subscribe this video For more articles on chemistry please visit our site chemistryonline.guru thank you